So hello everyone, this is a first shot from Innovate Yourself. This is our first video on virtual reality. Here I'm going to tell you how you can create your simple virtual reality game for a Google Cardboard. So for that I have already created a one scene with the name of the VR demo. And now I just enter into the browser and search here for a Google VR. After that, just scroll down, you will see there is one portal with the name of developer.google.com. So just open it, just scroll down, you will see there are different types of options are available for Java, Unity, Unreal and iOS. So here we are creating a game with the help of Unity. So just click on this, get it start. And after that, again scroll down and so just click on this release page. And here the GVR SDK file has appeared. Now in here there are different types of options are available like Google VR for Unity, this uh, uh, Unity package and Google VR for Unity, this is a source GIF. So now I'm going to download this Unity package. So just click over it. Once this package has downloaded, just open it and it will, it will be directly open in a Unity scene. Just click on all and just click on import. And now I am going to do few more settings. So for that I just click on file, go to the build setting. First of all I am going to switch from PC Mac to Android. So I just click on switch platform. And now I am going to add this scene. So I just click on add open scene. And again just go in player setting. In player setting I will just click on XR setting. After that I am going to check this virtual reality support. And inside of this, I am going to click on this plus button and you will see that different types of options are available like Google Cardboard, Daydream, Mock, HMD, None or Oculus. So here I am going to create this virtual reality game for a Google Cardboard. So for that I just click on Google Cardboard. After that again I just click on this other setting. And you will see there is an option of Volcan, so I just click it and click on mine. After that, I just enter into this scene, and here I'm going to create a VR scene first. So, for that, first of all, I'm going to create one plane. Okay, just increase the size of this plane. And after that, I am going to create one cube over it. So I just double click over it and move it little bit upward. Now I am going to create one folder with the name of material. So after that again I just click on create and click on this time material to change the color of a cube. So I just click on red and go into the inspector panel and click on this map again. Select the color and drag this color on a cube. Okay. Now after that, I'm going to download few assets. For that, I just click on package manager and click on my assets. Inside of this asset, these are the assets which I have already downloaded. So if you want, if you do not have download any asset, then you can go into the asset store and from here you can download the different types of assets. Okay, now I'm going to import this policy asset. So I just click on import. Just click on all and again just click on import. After that, again just click on scene. Go into the policy asset. And inside of this, you will see there is one folder with the name of texture and the different types of textures are available. So just open it. And I am going to place one grass type of structure from this. So I just select this plane structure and drag it on a plane. Now after that I am just click on this plus button and create an empty game object. And after that just make this main camera as a child of this empty game object. So just drag this main camera inside of this. And now I am going to fast forward this section. I am going to add a different prefabs and create a complete scene. So as you see I have completed a scene here. 
Now I'm just going to build this app and check the output on a Google Cardboard. So just click on File, click on Build Setting, and you will see the scene has already added here. So just click on Build, save this file with the name of VR app, and just click on Save to create it. So now we are entered into the VR mode. Okay. So as you see, the object which I have placed, I will able to view all that object. So as I move my head, like up and down, you will see, I will able to see the object which are placed over it. Now I am going to take one 360 view of all the scene. So as you see, I have moved my head in a 360 view and I will able to see all that object which I have placed there. So that's how you can create your own VR.